Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is probably gonna be the last video of 2019, which is why I rounded up lahat ng mga bagay na favorites ko and mga na use and abuse ko within this past 12 months. So if you guys are interested, then just keep on watching. Okay, first, because alam niyo naman how I love skincare, so let's begin with that. And my very first ones are these combination. Alam niyo na yan, I always show this sa Instagram ko, the Foreo. Um, this is the Luna Mini 2. Ito yung pinaka classic one. Nakadalawang ganto ko this year. However, ito medyo puno pa. Kaka-open ko lang. So, siguro one and a half of this for the whole year. Ginagamit ko lang siya at night kasi iba yung cleanser ko in the morning. But this combination is the best. Wala pa ako ibang nahanap na foamy cleanser na maganda and perfect for the for you other than this one tapos super super mura it's from Japan but meron na rin siya sa Watsons if tiyatamad kayo mag Watsons then you can get it from Skin International as well but these two are life savers tapos collagen this is my number one pick this is also from Japan it's called Hythiol C pag ito talaga yung ginagamit Lagi talaga, no fail. I always get compliments. Sobrang sarap mag-makeup kasi ang ganda sobrang ng lapat ng foundation ng makeup kasi nga close yung pores. And also, it's brightening, lightening lahat na. Pero ito talaga yung number one for me. And then the number two is the Neo Cell from USA naman. Ang maganda naman doon, nakakapagpatibay ng nails, nakapagpahaba ng hair. Maganda din siya sa mga joints. However, ang ayaw ko lang doon kasi nga, naka-IPL yung underarm ko. So, wala na akong hair doon. Pero since may biotin siya, kaya tumutubo na naman yung buhok ko sa hair. Although, pa unti unti lang. Kaya hindi ko siya continuously ginagamit kasi ayaw ko nung um, effect na yon on myself. Although, gumaganda yung hair, mabilis sumabap. Collagen in general, I cannot live without because if tinatamad ako mag-skincare, basta nagka-collagen ako, I am still glowing. And then, the only serum that I have in this video is um, the niacinamide of The Ordinary. Sobrang, sobrang ganda nito. Nahihirapan ako kasi sobrang dami kong ginagamit na serum. Every day, iba-iba. So, what I did is that I use one continuously na yun lang para lang ma-focus ko kung alin yung pinaka-favorite ko. So, ito, ito talaga yung number one. Lahat ng mga bumps and blemishes na tatanggal talaga every time I use this. So, sobrang perfect kasi nagaganto ako at nagaganto ako. Sobrang panalo. My skin is on perfect shape kapag ka I use the collagen and the niacinamide together. And this one also has the brightening effect. Medyo madami yung skincare kasi alam nyo naman na skincare junkie ako. Next is the face gym. Nothing else of this kind. So sobrang favorite na favorite ko talag talaga to. Even though I'm working out, nakakapag skincare pa rin ako kasi this is um, a training stick. So ang ganda ng technology nito because di ba pag uh, we're sweating and we're working out, nag-open up yung pores. So that's why you Put this all over your face before you start training. And the more you work out, the more you na pawisan ka, the more na mga pasok and nagpe penetrate and nag work yung ingredients nito. So, after mo mag work out, sobrang banat level, sobrang ganda. Alam mo yun, kasi para kang nasa sauna, kasi nga nag sweat ka, so open lahat. And then yung nutrients ng skincare na to is going inside. So, medyo may kamahalan nga lang to, but it's so worth it. And yan, sobrang laki. Gamit na gamit ko to, pero ang dami pa din yan. Yeah, you can also, of course, get this from Skin International. My favorite tool after Foreo is the gua sha. Mas gusto ko to kasi sa jade roller. Because yung jade roller, may tendency na maghiwahiwalay yung hardware niya. Kasi nga, um, naturally cold yung stone. Kaya, in the long run, kahit pa gano'ng kaganda yung quality, yung glue na nagpapakapit sa kanya is sumihiwalay. So, yun lang naman yung ayaw ko sa jade roller. This one is so compact and sobrang dali niyang gamitin. Ang downside lang nito, dapat naka-face oil ka or very, very moisturized face para mag-glide siya mabuti. Even pag may headaches ka, yung mga pressure points, sobrang useful niya. Lastly, this is it, um, in between skincare and makeup, which is my next one. This is the Kodali Beauty Elixir. So, this is what I use na setting spray. Medyo mahal din siya, pero ang maganda naman dito, it's a combination of um, setting spray and uh, skincare. Super, super favorite ng mga makeup artists. Pansinin nyo lang, every time na nags-stories yung mga stars na nasa makeup chair sila, hindi nawawala to. This is always there. And it's there for a reason, kasi sobrang ganda niya talaga. And it's from Paris. You can also get it on Simcar National, of course. Smoothing and glowing complexion after mo mag-spray nito. Next is makeup. I don't really use makeup a lot. Inisip ko ano ba yung palay ko talagang gamit the whole year. And I only have two products. And ito yung mga no-fail na sobrang easy na kahit ito lang ang meron ako, okay na ako. The first one is the, the Generation Happy Skin Kiss and Bloom Water Lip and Chick Tint. 
uh, in the shade Fearless. So, ito lang yung ginamit ko at towards the end of the year. No mga first part of the year is favorite ko yung BLK Cosmetics at saka yung water tint ng The Face Shop. Pero ito nga yung pinaka naging favorite ko sa lahat. Sobrang ganda niya. Naglalast talaga siya the whole day. Siya yung pinaka matagal matanggal sa lips. Kasi mostly naman maganda talaga for the cheeks. Uh, nagkakatalo na lang kung alin yung nagtatagal sa lips. So in fairness, this one is nagtatagal talaga sa lips. Then next one is nakikita niyo naman to sa lahat ata ng, vid ng makeup videos na napost ko this year. Ito yata yung ginamit ko. It's the Sunny's Face. Ang dami niya pa rin kahit lagi ko siya ginagamit. So, air Blush in the shade Moon. So, basta, maganda siyang cream blush. So, these two are my favorite makeup items plus the Kodali setting spray. This one is my third favorite topic is home products. So, unahin na natin. Alam na, alam nyo na. This is my Dyson V8 Animal. This was given to me by my ate. Sobrang gusto gusto ko nit talaga nito kasi we're living in a two-floor townhouse na maliit lang yung floor area. Kaya, perfect lang din siya. Kasi pag malaki yung house, I don't think this one is gonna be perfect kasi baka bago nyo matapos yung buong floor area nyo is ubos na yung battery. But perfect lang to sa house namin. Sobrang dali niya kasi for the stairs. And just ko, this one has made my life so much easier. And kahit si Don, gustong gusto niya to kasi pag nagbabaray na siya randomly, inaabangan ko na ng ganyan. Kaya hindi na kami nagkakalat and sobrang easy na talaga. So that is top one in my home list of 2019. Number two is the Korean All-Purpose Cleaner, Ionized Water. Ang daming ganito sa lahat ng corners ng bahay namin. Sa mga banyo, sa kitchen, sa mga bags namin, sa car, meron lahat. This is all-purpose. So for everything, I use it for the vegetables, I use it for the bathroom, I use it for hand sanitizer, makeup brushes, for everything talaga. Tapos water lang siya. Kala mo talaga, parang wala siyang ginagawa. Pero, grabe, pag spray mo lang ganyan, sobrang natutunaw talaga agad yung dirt. Kitang kita mo. Best example kasi for me also is that, di ba mahilig nga ako maglip and shake din. So, laging red yung ganito ko. Yeah, spray mo lang talaga na ganyan, nagdidrip na talaga agad yung red. So, doesn't dry my hands. Everywhere I go, pag nagdadrive ako, lahat ng kilos ko, bago ako mag-drive, I have to put alcohol. Kaya dry na dry yung kamay ko. But ever since I discovered this, never na ako naka-experience ng mga dry cuticles and all. This is the best. Mura lang siya. Parang, basta abot kaya siya. Just look at their website. Nandun naman yung prices. Next will be my Swiffer. Oh, ito, sobrang patok na patok din to. When I posted this on my Instagram and on my vlog, sobrang dami din sa inyong bumili nito. Still a favorite and it's still hands down the best mop for me. Sobrang helpful niya. Nakaninis talaga siya and it smells super good. And it really does the job. Next is this one. Nakalimutan nga man tawag dito. Nakalimutan ko yung tawag but i-research ko pag in-edit ko yung video and I'm gonna put this down. I saw this from Dyson and ginamit ko siya sa patuyuan ng mga plates namin sa baba and I'm just gonna insert a clip how it looks like. Hindi na kailangan ni drain kasi tumutulo dito yung water and, and, and then mag-evaporate. Pwede siya sa banyo and also I use it everywhere for most of my plants na nandito sa loob ng house na wala akong catch tray. Sobrang perfect niya kasi pag tumulo doon, hindi siya tatagos sa sahig. Mag-evaporate na lang siya. You just have to put it under the sun once in a while. It's very minimal lang. Akala mo wala lang pero it really does the job and sobrang panalo. Next one, I just recently got this. Amar Flex um, Air Purifier. I got this from the recent 11-11. Although hindi siya sale no 11-11. Pero ito kasi yung nakita ko Nung nag-11-11 sale, wala ka ibang gusto. Ito lang talaga. Tapos, ni naman siya ganun kamahal. It's just 2,500. And it purifies at least 15 square meters of space. So, perfect siya for each room. Isa lang muna binili ko para matry ko. So, then, ginagamit ko siya. Every time we sleep, gamit ko siya sa room namin. And then, minsan, kapag naglilinis ako ng kabilang room, which is this one, nilalagay ko siya doon. So, nililipat-lipat ko lang siya. It's so handy, kaya sobrang dali. It's more or less than a month pa lang since ginamit namin. And as you can see, kita nyo ba? Basta white to. White to nung dati. One month pa lang. Ayan yung filter. So, ibig sabihin, nakukuha naman niya yung mga dumi talaga and alikabok. And yeah, we have a dog. So, yun. Isa pa yun sa, syempre, kailangan ma-purify yung air because yung mga balahibo and all. Tapos yung mga alikabok. Sobrang useful nito and sobrang love ko to. I think I might buy more. Nag-sale to nung 12-12, 2,000 lang. Pero may iba nga akong binili ng 12-12. Kaya... Hindi muna ako bumili nito. But bibili ako nito for, for some other parts of the room. Isa-isahin ko. And then lastly, what you saw from my previous vlog is my iRobot. Although kakadating lang yung I know na it's one of my 2019's best investment. This one is still the best. I will use this 
for my stairs and for dito sa taas and para sa sasakyan. And then at least ito na lang yung mga kailangan ko. I-vacuum. Yung downstairs, nandun lagi si Barkley. Nandun lagi ako. Yun. Yung talagang literal na kailangan araw-araw or minsan twice a day pa. Trabaho na niya yun. So sobrang, 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 sobrang happy ko. So it even has a remote. So kilik ko na na umuwi na siya. It goes back to base. Those are the things that I love and that help me maintain our house this whole 2019 fashion. Onti lang to kasi sobrang simple ko lang din this. Wow, simple. But anyway, number one. <laughs> My use and abuse na kids. Ayan, obvious naman, di ba? Use and abuse. So, my kids na leather na white sneakers. Ayan, di ko na ipapakita kasi kadire. This sneakers is 3 or 4 years ago pa ata to. Napakadaming bansa na napuntahan nito. If all else fails, kung hindi ko talaga alam mga isusot ko na sabatos, ito lang. Kasi bagay talaga siya sa lahat. And it's super comfortable. I have never cleaned this in my entire life. See, kahit na ako saan saan na siya nakarating, ang ganda niya pa din. Bibili lang ako ng exact same pag nasira na to. Kung mapapansin niyo lahat ng mga travel photos ko, parang lagi siya yung dala ko. Minsan nga, gusto ko lang i-mix and match para lang magamit yung other shoes. Kaya lang, ito talaga yung bagay eh. Next one are my Lululemon leggings. I have 10 pieces na ata nitong plain black one and like ko na to pinapakita sa inyo. And ito yung Lululemon and then I have the colored ones also. I am obsessed with Lululemon and ever since I discovered this, nilet go ko na lahat ng other leggings ko. Wala na ako ibang leggings kundi itong Lululemon. Meron siguro mga isa or mga less than 5 pieces na ibang brand or unbranded para lang meron akong pang mga harabas. Pero Lululemon talaga. I live in Lululemon. Kung hindi ko alam ang suot ko today, I'm just gonna wear black Lululemon leggings and black top. Yun lang. Tapos kids. Yun na. Okay na. Solved na talaga ako. Another footwear and it's the Hermes Oran in the tan color. Ayan. Isa pa to. So kung maganda yung pa ako or yung manicure ko, then definitely I'm gonna wear this. If pangit yung pa ako, kids tayo. O kaya yung espadrilles ko na Chanel. Dapat iniisip ko kung sama ko sa espadrilles dito o hindi eh. Pero iniisip ko parang hindi ko naman siya nadala sa mga travels ko. So hindi siya worth it isama dito. Pero dito sa Pilipinas, gamit na gamit ko din siya. Pero ito kasing kids, gamit na gamit either dito sa Pilipinas or kahit sa ang parte ng mundo. So anyway, this one, sobrang gamit na gamit, sobrang bagay sa lahat, sobrang comfortable. Nung una, nahihirapan pa ako maglakad kasi napapraning ako kung maapakan or magagasgas, but hello, girl. <laughs> sabi nga ng friend ko, ano ba yan, kadire? Nung una, sabi niya, hindi mo man lang pinalagyan ng protector, but... Almost a year later, hindi ko na napalagyan. Bahala na. If magkakapera pa ako, I will buy another color of this. Kasi worth it talaga siya. So if you guys are thinking of buying this, buy it. Promise. Sulit siya. Last one in my fashion list is the denim jacket. This one is um fairly new. I got this from Zara. Parang mga five months ago. I have one na uh, two or three years old na. Na favorite ko din. So yun yung like kong ginagamit. And then when I got this, ibibenta ko na yun. I know na this is a favorite fashion piece because meron ako laging isang jacket sa car na doon na siya nakatira para whatever happens, whatever I am wearing, pag nilamig ako, kailangan masuot ko. So this one is the one. Dati yung isa nga, no fail outfit talaga. And when you travel, kung isa lang maladala nyo, just bring denim jacket. And lastly is the miscellaneous items. Yun yung mga bagay na hindi ko alam kung saan category siya lalagay. First one, alam nyo na, alam nyo na hindi ito mawawala sa listahan. My hydro flask. So any kind of hydro flask. Ito lang yung favorite ko ngayon kasi ito yung perfect na pang araw-araw na nakakailang ganito ako sa isang araw. Marami na yun ako nawala. Ang <laughs> dami namin sizes ng ganito. Yung mas malaki dito, this is 32 ounce ata. Yung 40 ounce yun yung perfect pag kaming dalawa ni Don. Pero dalawang ganun na yung nawala namin. You will never see me without it. Hindi ko kaya nang wala siya. Ano, kasi sobrang uhawin ko talaga. Sobrang mahilig ako sa water. Maybe that's also one thing that helps with my clear skin. I cannot live without cold water. That's why I cannot live without my hydro flask. This is really, really worth it. Kahit dalawang araw, iwan nyo dyan yung eyes, nandyan pa yun yung eyes. Sobrang, sobrang, sobrang sulit. Next one is reusable straws from eCorner PH. Bili na kayo dun kung hindi pa kayo nakakabili. Itong <laughs> tatlong to, ang lagi kong daladala sa bag ko every single day. This one is glass. And it's pointed. Kasi ito yung dati. Pero wala siyang point. Kaya ang hirap niyang itusok. Sobra ako nakakonsensya pag naiiwan ko to. I think I have contributed a lot with preserving Mother Earth this year. Sobrang naging good girl talaga ako. As much as I can. Next one. Lahat ng klase ng 
Tiger Balm. Ito, plasters. Dalawa yung laman nito. And then, ito yung lagi talaga namin ginagamit pag nag-travel kaming dalawa ni Don. Kasi sobrang bilis sumakit ng mga bagay-bagay every time we travel. Plaster really helps us a lot. Especially sa, sa likod namin. I have scoliosis. Si Don wala naman pero mabilis din sumakit yung likod niya. So, this is very, very helpful. And then, I have this and also the red one. This one is for mga headaches, mga ubo, sipon, keme. And then, the red one is for the muscle pain. Pero hindi ko masyadong bet yung amoy nun. Mas gusto ko yung white. So, eto mas ginagamit ko for everything. I have a small one in my purse. Meron sa car. Ito katabi ng bed ko. Cannot live without it. And then, ito yung recently medyo bago-bago lang. The Tiger Balm Inhaler na available only in Thailand. Wala pa dito sa Pilipinas. So, if you want some of this, I still have it available in Skin International PH. And just go. Ah, sobrang bango talaga. Next, dry shampoo. Batiste in particular. There's nothing else that I want except Batiste. Ito, tried and tested for 5-6 years. Ito na talaga yung ginagamit ko. Hindi ako lagi nag-shampoo kasi nga manipis na yung hair ko. And if hindi naman ako nag-shampoo, yun nga, sobrang oily niya. So I cannot live without this. And the cherry flavor is my number, number, number one favorite. Kaya lang madala siyang sold out sa states. Ito, kasi states ako kumukuha eh, kasi medyo mas mura doon. Hirap mga kuha ng cherry. So if meron, nag-hoard talaga ako. Other than that, I like the tropical as well. Best way to use this is spray this at night kasi may white cast siya. Yan, magiging grayish. But if you spray it at night, kahit pa sobrang puting-puti yan, pagising mo, ang ganda talaga ng volume. Parang very natural. It's the best. Then another hair product, ito, recently lang, this year ko lang din siya sinimulang gamitin. Actually, last year ko po na-discover, pero ang hirap maghanap ng color. Una ko tong nabili kay Ate Charm sa Look For Less and then nakabili din ako sa Watson sa Kota Kinabalu. And then finally now, dito sa Watson sa atin, available na lagi ang mga black and dark brown. This is the best because pag nakatali yung hair ko, so sobrang lipis ng hair ko, lagi nakalabas yung anit ko. Kaya, I just spray it. Para siyang concealer for your, ano, for your anit. So, you just spray it in the anit and it looks like full na black lang. So, it is the best. And then, I'm just gonna insert here. Sust, kasi nakatusok sila. The Susti sticks, it helped me a lot. Simula ng nalagyan ko ng ganon yung mga plants na hindi ko masyadong maintindihan kung anong gusto nila sa buhay. Finally, nagkaintindihan. It's color blue. It means it is hydrated and you don't need to make the leg. And if it turns white, it's time to make dilig. Kasi ibig sabihin, dry na. Dry na siya. Kaya ibig sabihin, dry na din yung soil sa paligid. So, it's really, really, really helpful. So, kung gumagastos kayo sa plants, gastusan nyo na rin yun. Kasi it's very, very, very um, sulit naman. I think you have to change the filter keme every 6 months. Never ko pang napaltan, but so far, gumagana pa naman yung sakin. It really, really helped me understand my plants and become a very good plant mom. <laughs> so, you guys, that's highly recommended. I got it from Plants Philippines or meron din silang website, Susti Philippines. And then lastly, my... <laughs> passport. Sobrang use and abuse this year. I've been blessed to travel a lot this year. Hindi ko in-expect. Kung masok yung 2019, alam ko lang na magta-travel kami ni Don this year. But in between ang daming mga nangyari na random na travels, I am very very thankful I'm very blessed kasi most of them are libre. Sobrang natataka ng mabuti si passport this year. Sana next year ulit. <laughs> At tagal kong inisip eh, kung ano ba yung mga ilalay ko dito kasi baka may mamiss ako. But these Things in front of me are the things that I know that I cannot live without the whole 2019. Ayun. So I hope you guys learned something from my vlogs this year. Thank you so much for everyone who subscribed. All 481 of you as of today. Konting konting na lang guys. 500 na. I'm very very grateful. Para sa akin sobrang dami na nun kasi hindi ko talaga in-expect na magiging ganun kadami ang subscribers ko. Nakakataba ng puso yung lahat ng mga DMs nyo and pagka natutuwa kayo sa mga sinishare ko, I will try my best to be able to share a lot more discoveries that I find next year. If you like this video, please give this a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you still haven't and I'll see you on my next one next year. Happy New Year, guys! Bye!